lounging, lounging with the laces. You and me, family. Lounging, oh, lounging, lounging with the laces. Changing the world one vlog at a time. One vlog at a time. One vlog at a time. The laces. The laces. Well, good morning guys and oh my goodness it has been seriously forever since we have vlogged um i have been the whole month of february pretty much sick after super bowl sunday um my health went like crashed down to the ground like um i've just been um dealing with some health issues that um Sorry, I'm trying to open the curtains to get some light in here. I need to clean up, but um, I've been dealing with health stuff that is like creeping back up because I haven't been taking care of myself um, like I need to. So um, I've been dealing with that. Still, am dealing with it. I'm just in a better um, place with it. Oh my goodness, these curtains are killing me. Um, oh my gosh, the house. So I, I obviously have to clean up. It's a hot mess. Um, and close that. So yeah, so I've been dealing with a bunch of health stuff for the whole month. Um, it's Monday and Jimmy's off today. He is at, we have two gym memberships. He goes to one gym to do his weight training and then we go to another gym. Um, we're going to do our cardio today. And um, he doesn't do weights there. He trains me there, but he doesn't do his weights there because he needs to drop the weights and you can't do that there. Um, no like grunting and all that. And he's bodybuilding. So, I mean, he trains to failure. So he drops the weights um, when he's not training to failure. Then he'll like lift weights a little bit with me. But anyway, um, so I'm waiting on him to come home to pick me up. Um, so I I don't know if I'm going to share like my health stuff or not. Um, I've been dealing with this for years, but um, a couple about four years ago, I was able to pretty much, I won't say cure, I will say um, maintain or get rid of some of the health stuff that I was dealing with. And um, just over time just you know we had Jimmy's brother live with us for a year then we had both his parents live with us for about a year then we adopted a dryer she's been with us for three years so just me taking care of other people my house and all that I wasn't making um, my health a priority and it just crashed <laughs> so um, I will be today just starting and focusing all the month I like the first week I was like in the bed couldn't move Jimmy cooked took the kids to sports did all that stuff for me um worked all day and then the following week he was like out of town three times um so I had to like get myself together <laughs> so I was able to do a little bit of stuff but that whole week I did like fast food because I was like feeding them, taking them to class, school, getting back in the bed. Like that was my daily routine. And um, so now I'm just <clears throat> trying to um, get back focused on myself and get myself in order. So um, I'm going to go to the gym for the first time this year today. And I'm just going to walk. And, um, you know, I need to um, be doing cardiovascular stuff for my whole mental state for my body just for my health and um just trying to take my vitamins and i've been juicing every single day um as you guys see in my grocery hauls i've been buying stuff to juice i know that has something to do with why i'm feeling a lot better i've been juicing every day and then i've been taking my vitamins every day um so yeah uh, i've been doing that now it's just time for me to get my um cardiovascular up so yes yeah, so we're gonna go to the gym for about an hour or so and I'm just gonna walk or either get on the bike depending on how crazy it is I've never gone to the gym at the beginning of any year 
that I can ever think of because I always think those are always like the beginner people. So <laughs> they're like starting these diets and then it is so busy and then it kind of fades off in March. So I've always gone to the gym from like March through fall time or something like that. Um, so we'll see how busy it is, but Jimmy's going to be there with me. So that's good. Um, and then I'm just going to um, try to start back tracking my food. If you guys have our friend friends with me on fitness pal haven't been doing that because I haven't been able to do that um, so I'm gonna be tracking food again and just like starting to get back on a routine get my cleaning schedule back in order uh, I'm gonna be pre cooking myself and Jimmy's meals and then just making the kids like one pot meals um, to make it easy so yeah that's pretty much what's going on he should be here any minute he's got to do my measurements and stuff for me too um, I, so I'm going to wait on him to do that. I weighed in already this morning and then we'll do our weight loss video update uh, the 1st of March or the last day of February, somewhere around there. We usually have been updating once a month and he's doing really good on his so I, I won't have too much to report in February since I've been dealing with health stuff but I'm glad to be back vlogging. Daniel has been like... <laughs> asking me like every three or four days mom we're, what's going on why are we not vlogging so um it, it's time to get back in the swing of things and start back our family memories and um we had a great valentine's day with the kids i always post stuff on instagram so if i'm not vlogging you guys can kind of catch up with me there it's just super mama three plus one so um you can um friend me there and um, usually I update different stuff. So like our Valentine's Day, I think I posted something. So we had a good time though. And then, um, we will be getting Nay on March 6th. So I'm excited about that and she'll be home for the whole weekend. So, um, that'll be good for her to be, you know, back in her own bed and hanging out with us. So that'll be good. Um. And then she goes back like that Monday or something. But she calls us once a week. We've been sending letters. We sent the Valentine's Day stuff. She sent it back. She's been like one of the really good kids um, at the school. So she said her team, the girls on her team are kind of bad. They don't shut up where they're supposed to. So they get in trouble because, you know, you can't talk in the halls. And you have to like do your march and do all that stuff. And she said they can be a little hard-headed sometimes. So... <laughs> Um, they get in trouble sometimes, but she says she has been asked by like the director and a lot of their squad leader people to do different stuff. She was able to go out into the community and do some stuff. Um, they are now going to church, which is in town, like five minutes from Jimmy's job. They are going to this church over there. So, um, she signed up for like the little church group or whatever. It's whoever signed up for that are able to go. So she signed up for that. And then I think she's going to do some, some other sport thing. I'm not quite sure. And she said when she comes home on the 6th, she'll be able to get her makeup and scented lotions. You know, they, they, they took all, they strip you of all that stuff, but now she will be 10 weeks in or something like that. So they're able to start incorporating different stuff. So um, she'll be able to do that. So of course she's excited. She can take her makeup. Um, and then what else? She's making money every month. They get an allowance. So she said when she comes home, she'll bring $60 home. Um, and then when you finish the program, I think you get like $2,200 or something when you finish the entire program. So it's just to help with like either if they need to get a car or if they are going to college and need money for books or whatever they're going to do. So she's still 16. A lot of the girls, she's actually one of the youngest and she's one out of two girls that are from our area. Everybody else is from St. Louis and Chicago. So um, our local community college will be cheaper for her because she's in district. So we got to figure out what we're going to do since she's still 16. And we got to see if she's going to pass a GED. If she doesn't pass a GED, she gets, um, in March, she takes a test. And then in May, she takes a test. And I think right before she graduates, she's able to take another one. But if she doesn't pass, then we have to obviously sign her up for either adult ed or GED testing something and pay out of pocket, which I think is pretty expensive. So I'm hoping that she does her best and um, passes the test. So, um 
so yeah so i'm going to clean up they've got guns and bullets everywhere on the floor so i've got to get get all that stuff up some dirty socks and some uh, a hat looks like Daniel forgot his hat and then i need to move the table and chairs back in the middle um daniel and jariah have um recital coming up so they've been practicing a lot yeah so sorry for the super long intro so <laughs> i'm gonna start straightening up and then i need to put something on my stomach before we go to the gym probably just a half a banana um because i don't actually feel that hungry um i still like have that nauseous feeling going on so eating is like uh <clears throat> so yeah i got that little nauseous feeling still going on so i might just eat something like a half a banana or maybe even a protein shake just something liquid so um, i'm going to clean up start cleaning up he should be here well now he said 9 20 and he's not here yet so um, but he was changing up his weight routine, so it may take him a little bit longer. But he's off today, so technically we can go to the gym whenever we want. So, um, yeah, so I need to straighten up, and we need to send Nay a letter actually out today. People, it's been a while. How you guys been doing? Today is day one, and we're serious this time, guys. We finna uh, really chime in on the focus on fitness. <laughs> in shape uh, we did our measurements about to go head back to the gym and it's day one I hope you guys having a great day today is my day off as you might see in the background it did snow like 30 inches <laughs> um, 30 inch. but yeah today is a good day hope you guys having a great day head to the gym I went to the gym earlier to do my weight training and now I'm about to go, me and my wife are about to go to Planet Fitness, do some cardio. And then um, that'll be it. We'll kick it the rest of the day. I got to go work out a client a little bit later on. And that'll be it. So see you in yeah. a bit. Peace. How'd you do, honey? Huh? <laughs> Frazzled a little bit. Like what machine did you use? I did the elliptical. Yeah. It was good. Got a good 50 minutes on and then I did the, I just walked on the treadmill, so there's, yeah, I burned 433, none of it was vigorous, it was slow walking, and it had me walk 6,469 steps, so today's workout is done. So we're going to go home and have our breakfast, um, and then i got to finish straightening up. And chill, have a, have a, enjoy honey's work day off. Yes. We gotta, yeah, me too. So we gotta head home and then have our breakfast. Hey guys, today is Monday and I just got off from school and we're at my brother's school. So we're just waiting in the car for him. So yeah, I'm just drinking some lemonade. Why you ain't been vlogging, man? Because you guys didn't give me the camera. <laughs> because mm -hmm. we need him. Come on. Okay, see ya. What up, people? Oh, what we've been up to. Where have the Lacey's been? Well, you know what? Life. Life happens, right? So things come up. 
and then your priorities change and shift but we're starting to settle back down so guess what we got to pick back up the camera sorry we couldn't bring y'all along through the journey it is what it is but that's what we've been up to me i've been getting my fitness stuff ready um i'm really about to take off up in that um been doing some things you know. um just a lot of stuff going on and my job changed actually so i was gone a lot too as well so got offered a new position that you turned down yeah i got offered a, a new <laughs> job position that i did turn down they wanted to move a brother up in the company but i had to turn him down you know because it would have took away. <laughs> I was gonna say you gotta keep a brother down. They, they tried to keep me down. No, they tried no. to bring me up, but I had to keep, keep myself down. down. I had to keep myself you down. People. No, it would have took. It would have really took away from my family and the things that I wanted to do, and that's one of the most important things to me. You know, a lot of people. I don't. You know, money does change a lot of things and stuff. Help out, but a lot of people sacrifice. Their family for the money, and at this, yeah, I just can't do it. You know, maybe they was offering me three, four hundred thousand a year. I would have did it, but they was offering me only what two hundred and sixty thousand to move up. And I, <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're crazy. They was only offering just, me two, just two hundred and sixty thousand a year. I wasn't plus stock options and. The car, a whole bunch of stuff, but you know. You ain't want all that. I ain't want all that. I ain't want that stuff. Your car? I'm not. I'm not a material type of guy. You know. <laughs> That's it. Even though I would have bought me a Bungati. <laughs> a who? <laughs> I woke up in my Bungati. <laughs> Is your father out of his mind, Moon? <laughs> But that's what we've been up to. Right now we're waiting for Sean. After this, we gotta go to the store. And then after that, I gotta go train a client of mine. Try to get him some muscles, bulking up. So I need to bulk that's up. That's it. Moon wanna bulk up. You wanna bulk up, bud? I need to bulk up. Build some muscles. Bulk up. Let me see your muscles. Mine is on the Sean. Uh-oh, look at this spider shirt. How the fuck is your muscles? Okay. There you go. Get it, get it out. Look at that. Look at that, people. Look uh, at the genetics. Show it, boo boo. Oh. That's a, that's at least ten inches right there, people. You measured it. Yeah. Ten inches. <laughs> so gets it from his father. Makes the daddy proud, knowing that his son gonna be ripped up one day. He gonna take over the cup. Yeah. It is. The That's what it's all about. That's my legacy right there, people. You know, he be bad sometimes, but <laughs> you know, you gotta take the good with the bad too as well. Moon, you be bad? No. <laughs> Come on, Moon. Not at school. Not at school. What about at home? Yeah. At home. What you be doing at home? Can Telling you yourself. Up? You know. Beating your brother up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Getting beat up by your brother. And then he punches me in the face too hard, so I get scrambled. Alright, they go to mm. my oldest child. What happened, son? You know about Chuck? Oh, yeah, you found out? No, Mr. Carlisle said that it was some, for some people I already started, but at lunch, uh, a person or a guy he gave you this, what it starts in. And, oh, tryout? Yeah. Oh. Did he miss him? No. Nope. Are you gonna go? It's when is tryout? March six. March six. All right. Six. So what do you want to do? Baseball or track? Track. Okay. Any of your friends gonna go out? Yeah. Uh oh. Okay. Well, it's time to get that body in shape. Yep. Um, Daddy's gonna show you a couple things. All right. We gonna head out, people. See you in a bit. Peace. Sean's doing his homework and working on a project that he has to do tries dancing you have to pick up your stuff sweetheart pick up your backpack and your coat and your shoes what's the problem okay so it's about four o'clock and i've started meal prepping so this is like a pasta meal that the kids will have for dinner tonight and some chicken with that but it's still in the oven i made some eggs some hard-boiled eggs me and jimmy a thing of rice 
what it's gonna call. And then a thing of plain pasta. So I'm still working on, I gotta do chicken and steak and some other chicken that's in the oven for the kids. So just trying to prep up some stuff to have already ready to go in the fridge. All right, I'm putting the steaks on the grill. I got everything else done. So I pan up the, I had three chicken breasts and I cut them in half and then I chopped them up into little small pieces. So we get these with veggies throughout the week. 